Okay, I really hope there's enough battery life for me to say good morning, Shiners and possibly Shiners. Wow, first day back to school and I'm already running late. Fun, 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 fun. To the point where I nearly killed myself again, tripping over that stupid gate to the living room. Awkward cut. Okay, first off, super slow-mo, I've got to remember to turn that off when I turn it on. It is very annoying how when the switch goes from auto to program and slow motion's on, and I don't know, it's annoying because something I recorded something earlier today and it was in slow motion, so I'll get to that. I had um, drama club today. That's why I'm not walking around. Oh, I put that in quotes. Yeah, I'm not walking around my uh, kitchen and downstairs talking about my day. Anyways, uh, what I said in that clip that was accidentally slow motion, which would have been better if I actually had a clip from that time of the day. Excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Oh, I said dinner. Uh, it would have been funnier, I guess. Basically, a great way to start the first day back to school after vacation is getting coffee sneezed in your hair. Yes, the person behind me in my first block class had coffee. He always has coffee. Like, he doesn't have time to drink it in the morning. And he said, like, for some reason he couldn't swallow, which means he was either laughing or, like, had to sneeze or burp or something. And so I'm spitting it all over my hair. It's like, Happy New Year! Did you have a good vacation? Here comes coffee! Welcome back, spit take. Ow. And that's all the various puns, or I guess you could make from that situation. But yes, I got coffee pretty much spit or sneezed or something, coughed, I don't know, on me. So my clean sweatshirt got dirty. Um, if I wasn't wearing a sweatshirt, then my shirt would have gotten dirty. Um, I got all of my hair, but miraculously, yes, got in the place just itched. Gross. I, I washed it out. If I, the last clip wasn't in slow motion, you would see that I had my hair was like wet and such. Anyways, um, I filmed inside the bathroom to report on it the second it had finally been able to wash it out of my hair. But unfortunately, it didn't work. That's annoying. Um, anyways, yeah, so, I, yeah, that was a great way to start my, uh, Day. Um, also, at Drama Club, um, on ThinkGeek, there's this, I'm not sure if ThinkGeek originally, like, sells this, they might, something else, some other place might also sell it, but they have this, like, shirt that's like a playable guitar, and, uh, someone actually had it today at, a uh, Drama Club rehearsals, so, that was, that was pretty cool, um, yeah, speaking of ThinkGeek, I'm behind on friend birthday gifts, I'm like, okay, to all my friends to have to uh, to hopefully get their birthday gifts uh, on time, which I think I only missed one person, and that's Josh, which his birthday was on the 30th. Uh, anyways, um, so um, I said I go to my friends. And I said, okay, for your birth for your next birthday or event when you get a gift, which technically would include Christmas, but I'm Jewish, so. I don't get um, get Christmas gifts, or maybe I will next year, I don't really know. Anyways, this year I didn't, and last year I didn't, and so like that. Anyways, um, so I'm like, okay, so for your next birthday, or any other time that you need gifts, theoretically, um, you get one item, $30 or less from ThinkGeek, and so I have to, um, well, I think my last Hanukkah gift as well, but I have to order, like, the next couple of birthdays for my friends, uh, gifts, so I have them to give to them on their birthday. Since I, this is like last year, I believe, um, it took like several months to get my friends their uh, gifts, like it was like half a year after their birthday, I'm like, oh, happy birthday, and I gave them these uh, magnetic neodymium balls called Bucky Balls, which uh, I'm not sure my friends, if they have them still, have all 216 of them. Um, but yeah, so I'm, I said, yeah, Think Geek, one item. So they actually have to look on Think Geek when they get the chance, tell me what they want, then I have to order it. Okay, yeah, so I'm now going to purchase those gifts. Gifts, gifts, whatever. I'm going to purchase them and then get to my homework. Awkward cut. Oh, well, the most exciting thing that happened today was 
someone spitting coffee accidentally on the back of my neck. Um, but uh, good night, whoever's watching this. See you tomorrow. I won't see you, but you will see me. And why did I walk out of my room when we're saying good night? Awkward cut to outro. There's a vlog on the web featuring Ben Stock that he shoots every day as he walks and talks. If you're Bigfoot in the woods or producers in LA, you should stop all your shit and watch Sunshine Shade. Sunshine Shade. Sunshine Shade. Has nothing to do with Florida, but it's great. If you can't wait, don't get irate. Just stay in your sheet, cause it's sunshine well, shade. I won't see you, you will see me.